Hey everybody, it's Hunger again, and I'm back with another episode of Pokemon Serious version. So let's get started. So if you haven't seen the last episode where I battled Judy the Gym Leader, uh, you may want to go back and watch that, because I'm about to talk about it. So, uh, yeah. Anyway. Uh, so last time, I came uh, down here and couldn't use Flash. I got the HM for Flash, but couldn't use it because, uh, because I didn't have the badge from the gym leader. Uh, so now that I've defeated Judy and have the badge, I can go ahead and use Flash, so we're doing that. I taught Kuppa how to use Flash, mainly just because I don't plan on keeping Kuppa ver for very long. Uh, I might just keep it until it evolves and then get rid of it. So, because uh, cause I already have a water type in my starter, so. Finally. My name is Steven. I'm searching for rare Pokemon, so I travel here and there. Oh, a letter for me? Okay, thank you. You went through all this trouble to deliver that. I need to thank you. Let me see. I'll give you this TM. It contains one of my favorite moves, Aerial Ace. Okay, you're lying. <laughs> you're like, you're like, I only use Steel types. So I don't need this move here. <laughs> Come on. Your Pokémon appear quite capable. If you keep training, you could even stand at the peak of all Hoenn's trainers one day. That's what I feel. But right now, there's something even more attractive to me than the title of champion. Well, I must be going. Is, is he hitting on me? What's going on? Alright, so now that I've finished delivering that letter to Steven, I can go ahead and head off of this island. Ahoy! For you, I'll go out to sea any time. Now, my friend, where are we bound? We're going to Slateport. Slateport, is it? Anchors away, Pika! We're setting sail, my darling! You probably shouldn't call your Pikachu your darling. Just throwing that out there. Ahoy! We've made land at Slateport. I suppose you're going to visit Captain Stern and deliver the Devon goods. It won't lose to rain or even disasters. Slateport is truly the best port. Alright, cool. Whatever works, buddy. Sailor Huey. Okay. This is a bad matchup for me. Good. Bow out. There we go. Alright. Get him. Sword, go. Rough Talia. Alright. I guess use cut. She's my sword and everything, so. Is it okay to have her cut things? Look at that. Quick attack, finish it off. Boom. Take that. All the XP. You're the best. Darn right. In the best port was the best trainer. This guy. This guy knows what's going on. I like him. I can't swim, so I'm practicing. Oh, jeez. Tuber Haley. I 
also can't win a battle. When I learn how to swim, my Pokemon will definitely become tougher. Uh, huh? Battle? Sailor Edmund. That is a polywag. I'm going to hit it. I'm going to start hitting you now. I don't know when I'll stop. <laughs> Destroy him! Come on. Can't you destroy him a little bit? are learning sleep so early in the game. That's, that's not cool. What's wrong with him? I'm usually stronger than this. I'm just seasick as a dog right now. I'm a sailor, but... Ah, uh, I'm hungry. If I win, give me something to eat. I don't give people things to eat. Who do you think I am? with me when I'm not all hungry? Yeah, I guess. Oh, wait. No, don't don't register. Stop registering stupid people in the Pokenab. I'm getting famished. All the sand is starting to look like sugar. Yeah, eat the sand. If you're looking for a battle in the seashore house, you'll find no hotter trainer than me, matey. Alright. Whatever works. Sailor Dwayne, oh gosh. It's the rock. Get him. Oh no, fire's power was weakened. Now I can't use my fire attacks as effectively. so darn confusing about hitting a tentacle in the face anyway. Get him. Alright. Give me that XP. Yes! That's what I wanted. More levels. 
that was a hot battle. From now on, you're the hottest trainer here. Gee, thanks. Boring battles aren't worth the effort. Fiery hot battles where both sides go all out are the best. Alright, cool. Beauty Johanna. She got a gold name. Do you call that going all out? Seriously? Is that, is that your... Is that serious mode? Take that. Stop with the stamping confusion. It's so annoying when every single trainer has the same tactics. Oh, I'll put you to sleep. I'll confuse you. It's literally every single trainer. It doesn't matter if the Pokemon change if they all do the same freaking thing. Wow. Wow. Phew, I'm all thirsty. I think I'll take a little break. I'm going to show you how strong my Pokemon are, so let's battle. Alright, kid. Why not? Tuber Simon. Alright. That's an Azuril. Yeet! Oh, good. Good. Best move. Whoa! Take that. A uh, Meryl. Do you have Splash as well? Because that would be awesome. You can just Splash instead of doing actual damage. That's a defense curl. I don't like it. It's making me nervous. Raising its own defense and lowering mine. Alright, well, didn't get to do anything, so that's fine. <laughs> I lost, but I won't cry. You won't get me crying? If one of my Pokemon that knew the move for carrying me across the water on its back, I could get rid of this inner tube. You're scorching hot. Those battles blazed. I'm more than just satisfied, as thanks for showing me your hot streak, I want you to take these. It's half a dozen bottles of soda pop. Hey, That's actually useful. A potion? Brilliant! Isn't a beach umbrella really pretty? Hey, my inner tube's cool, right? If I'd known there were two of them, I would have taken them on one at a time. Two were Lola and Chandler. Azuril and Dorfin. Wait a minute! It's adorable, I want one. Give me. There's a new Pokemon over there. Don't. S okay, it's singing. That's not cool. I probably just made a mistake. I probably should have just left the Azuril sit over there. Come here. I'm sorry, Dorfin. I've got to get rid of you. You're too dangerous. Acting like it's supposed to be a dolphin with that name, but like it looks more like a seal. <laughs> it's still cute. Don't get me wrong. I want one. Ew. Goodbye. 
forgot my attacks that have been lowered. Take that. Alright. This will be... Oh my gosh. Come on, really? Destroy him! Her. It. Okay. Where's my soapy pop? I thought he said I got a dozen bottles. I guess it was a half dozen. I don't know. That sucks. Take that. Uh. Mommy! Oh, oh, too bad. Me? I'm here every day. Oh, God, no! After I showed you my cool inner tube, too. The water around these parts is clean. But I get my Azumarill to pick up litter from the shoreline at times. Dirty water becomes rain and joins our rivers, which we drink from. We pollute the sea, it all comes back to haunt us eventually. Okay, Wilford Brimley. Hey, I got a Soothe Bell. What is that over there? That long line. Hey there, quit pushing. This is the line, can't you see? Team BH has a policy of assembling and dispersing as a group. Our leader is brilliant. What would he want to do with the museum now? Urgh. I should have brought my DS so I wouldn't get bored in line. Urgh. What? What do you want? You want to read this sign? I'll read it for you. Let's see. Uh, I think it says something like, The life in the sea is endless. Yep, I'm pretty sure that's what it says. When this operation's over, I'll take you to a hot spring spa. That's what our boss said. I can't wait. Hey, you there, don't butt in. If there's something we need in the museum, we should take it all. What's the new scheme, I wonder? I'm scared of getting punished by our leaders, so I'd better not screw things up. A long line, huh? It reminds me of the times I lined up to buy Smash Hit games. Why are we even in line and paying? We should just march in. Where could Captain Stern have gone off to? Could you go find Captain Stern and deliver that parcel to him? All right, so the huge line is gone now. Welcome to the Ocean and Meteorite Museum. The entrance fee is 50. Would you like to enter? Sure, why not? What up, girl? We, Team BH, exist for the good of all. Really? Yes. If you're looking for Stern, that would be me. Ah, that must be the device I ordered from Mr. Stone of Devon. You saved us, thank you. We can prepare for our expedition now. Ah, oh, here they come. Heh <laughs> hold it, we'll take that device. What? Who are you people? We're Team BH. Our leader wants that device, now give it to me quick. Alright, listen, Team Butthurt. <laughs> you can't just be rolling up here. Tox Roach? Okay. guys. It's gonna be great. Don't you screech at me. This thing's got some heckin' defense. Oh, come on. That's such a lame move. Roach. I wish it would get wrecked. Yeah. A oh, what? Uh, a kid beat me. Yeah, get out of here. Oh man, what a disaster. Our leader is going to be furious. In that case, I'll fight you. I'm much stronger than the other guy. <laughs> That's what they all say. out of level 100 Rayquaza and kills me. <laughs> it's, a, it's a nice Zubat you got there, buddy. Have some horn attack. Put a horn in on the action here. Tox Roach again! have like a whole extra Pokemon compared to that other guy. Oh my gosh, come on! 
Stupid detect. Friendship evolutions because I've got a Soothe Bell. And if any of my Pokemon evolve via uh, happiness, then I totally need to put that on there. <laughs> Take that. I'll smack you around. Come here. Alright. What? Am I actually weak? Uh, yeah, totally. Hey, uh, if we don't get the device, we're in for it. Or I can't believe we got stopped by a kid. What was that? You were taking so long that I came up here to check on you. And you're playing with some kid? We are the evil organization, Team BH. I thought you were here for the good of everyone. And I'm Team BH's leader, Wallace? Really? What makes you interfere with us? Could you perhaps be a member of Team WH? Wait, that can't be right. You're not dressed for the part. Pokemon, people, they're always fighting and hurting each other. We've realized how foolish that is, and that is why we must change the world. In order to do that, we, Team BH, must become the rulers of the world. Oh, you don't understand? It's all right. As long as you don't get in our way, we won't get in yours. Well then, farewell. And he's gone. You're... Ah, okay, you're Famine. Anyway, that was a tense situation. Thank you for saving us. Oh yes, I almost forgot that you even brought the device from Devin. There you go. You can have that. Whoops, it's almost time. We have to set out on our ocean floor expedition really soon. Thanks again, but now I've got to go. Feel free to wander around and check out our facilities, though. Gah, what are you doing here? Me? I'm the Team BH member you thumped before, remember? Back in Rust Turf Tunnel? Here, take this and leave me alone. Yo! That TM, it suits you more than it does me. I hope I never see you again. Wahahaha! <laughs> he gave me facade. Ah, you again. It's me, the Moss. The Moss! I said it twice for emphasis. I heard the Team BH is causing trouble, so... Huh? You already took care of it. What a surprise! Even though I was going to get rid of them myself. Today's grand surprise goes to you. So let's register his oh god. Registered Maz <laughs> Call me anytime. Oh, except for nighttime, since I'll be asleep. If I don't answer, it's because I'm busy at my other job. Farewell, famine! Alright, everybody, that's gonna be it for this episode. Thank you all so much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed it. Look forward to the next one, and as always, I hope everybody has a great day. Bye-bye!